Welcome back to our channel. And today we're going to discover the Swiss countryside, the most beautiful villages and the best tourist programs. So stay with us. The Swiss countryside enjoys a picturesque and special nature, overlooking rivers and surrounded by green and snow-covered mountains on all sides as well as a tranquil atmosphere. That's why, as I mentioned before, our focus today is on villages and nature tourism programs. Our trip today is all about discovering the beauty of Switzerland. Interlaken is located in the middle of Swiss villages and nature tourism programs, so the starting point for our trip is the town of Interlaken. Living in Interlaken is a good thing, because the city is closer in beauty to a village and closer to programs and villages. For example, if we stroll through the heart of Interlaken to the market, you'll discover the beauty of the interweaving of nature and atmosphere, which means you'll see the mountains and nature that surround it on all sides. Secondly, the river Area flows through the town and past the market, so you can enjoy the atmosphere and spend a pleasant moment in a beautiful landscape while sampling chocolate and traditional Swiss food. By the way, Interlaken is situated between Lake Thun and Lake Brienz, and there are many activities available on these lakes. We will talk more about that later. But first, we'd like to know about the villages and the best tourist programs. Of course, renting a car at the airport is the best way to travel in Switzerland, for several reasons we mentioned in the last episode. So watch the episode, you'll find it very important. The first village we visit is Grindelwald. This alpine village lies at an altitude of around a thousand meters. It's a beautiful area and one of the favorite villages to live in. It's also the best region for adventure. The villages of the Swiss countryside are characterized by their beauty, picturesque nature and tranquility, making them some of the best places to spend a vacation and relax. I will include in the description box below the best hotels and resorts in each village. We'll get to know some of them on this trip. The important thing is that the best tourist program in this village is Grindelwald the first. The price of this program is 124 Swiss francs. This amount includes the ascent to the summit and a choice of five adventures in several stations. The itinerary is as follows. First, you take the cable car to the summit, where the views are magnificent. For your information, the program provides information in several languages. Then walk to the top of the mountain above the clouds and have a snack in one of the Europe's oldest and highest restaurants. And after that, you walk to the observation platform suspended on the mountain slopes and enjoy a unique and imaginative view. Then the adventure begins. You can choose the Eagle's slide or the zipline to take to the skies over the plains. Then you start your descent in a mountain car. This vehicle starts cautiously and of course has brakes to reduce speed. All these programs take place in the same place and on several levels from the top of the mountain at the summit to the descent and arrival at the front gate. Then you arrive at another station and hop on a scooter to ride through the village of Grindelwald between the houses and the plains. In my opinion, this is the most beautiful adventure in Switzerland and I consider Grindelwald to be one of the most beautiful villages that deserve to be visited. And we move on to another village and begin a new adventure. We arrived at Lotterbrunnen. This is one of Switzerland's largest nature reserves. It's said to be the most beautiful valley in the world comparable to the beauty of the Norwegian valleys. Frankly, Switzerland is like a piece of Norway in the middle of Europe. This valley lies at the foot of the Alps between giant boulders or rock faces and mountain peaks. There are more than 70 waterfalls in this valley, and the first to catch the eye is the Staubach waterfall, which plunges from a height of 300 meters The valley is dotted with houses designed in the Swiss chalet style. 
There are many fine things to experience in the valley, including good huts, cabins and hotels. One of the latter, the Storbark Hotel, overlooks the waterfall. The valley is 12 kilometers from Interlaken, which is a 20-minute drive from Interlaken to Lauterbrunnen. In this beautiful valley, three kilometers away, is another beautiful waterfall called Trommelbach. This waterfall is one of the most beautiful and strange in the world. It is located inside the mountain, in caves and cold passages. These glaciers have formed this terrible imaginary scene. One of the best and most important programs in Switzerland is the Jungfrau Summit. This is one of Europe's most famous and highest peaks. It can be climbed by train and is considered the highest peak reached by train in Europe at an altitude of around 3,500 meters. It can be reached from Lauterbrunnen or Grindelwald or even from the town of Interlaken. The ascent takes around an hour and a half and tickets cost 190 francs. At the top, there are large areas reserved for skating. And we move to another village and another program. Underground. It's a beautiful area overlooking rivers and lakes, situated just a 30-minute drive from Interlaken. It is dotted with alpine houses and features many magnificent landscapes. One of its most important programs is the Blue Sea. This lake is the jewel of the Alps. It's surrounded by an imaginative natural garden with charming paths as if you were walking through the Amazon jungle. The lake is beautiful with deep blue water. Don't forget to take the boat and see the mermaid statue at the bottom of the lake. The garden is open from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. and tickets cost 9 francs, a great place to enjoy with family and friends. We're moving to another village and another program, so stay with us. Just so you know, the driving is great in Switzerland. You'll see fantastic views during the trip and the streets are quiet, uncrowded and easy. Of course, there are hundreds of villages in Switzerland, the most beautiful of which is located in Berner Oberland, which includes part of the Alps and Lake Berner. You can reach Gelmurban Valley in 45 minutes from Interlaken. This is an imaginative program. From the moment you arrive, you'll be walking on a wooden bridge between hills, waterfalls and cows, all surrounded by mountains. If you want to discover the beauty of Swiss nature, you should follow this program. Take the funicular to the top and a tip for a magnificent view is to try sitting at the front. This funicular is open and is the steepest in Europe. At 106, it rises slowly to offer a fantastic view. You'll find yourself in the sky, surrounded by snow-capped peaks. When you reach the summit, you discover another impressive view, that of the turquoise lake at the top of the mountain. This is a beautiful place for photography, walking and contemplating natural beauty. Now, please focus on me, this information is very important. Remember that all tickets are always booked a month or two in advance, so the ticket must be booked on the main website. When booking, you will choose the day and time of departure. You must arrive 10 minutes before the appointment. If you're late for the train on the way back, you'll have to walk down and you'll need to be in very good physical shape. The ticket costs 36 francs. We move now to the village of Adelboden. This village is situated in the Alps at an altitude of around 1300 meters. It can be reached by car and is about an hour's drive from Interlaken. It's a very peaceful village surrounded by nature and waterfalls. 
The village is very close to the summit of Albristhorn, the highest peak in the Alps. Anyone wishing to get away from the bustle of the city should book a hotel called Ferrian and Familian, a good, quiet Swiss hotel. The hotel offers magnificent views over the village, and the mountain peak is very close by. The view is impressive from the breakfast room. The price per night for two persons is 150 francs, including breakfast. What's also important is that it features walking trails surrounded by nature, known as hikes. You can also enjoy the beautiful staggered houses on the plains. You can visit Seal Park, which is a park for children and adults, and also offers a zipline adventure. But the best program or adventure in Interlaken Adel Boden or even Switzerland is parachute jumping. And get ready to fall in 45 seconds from a height of 4,000 meters. It's the best way to get close to the Alps and enjoy the view and the adventure. So we move now on to another village and another program. Zermatt. It is one of Switzerland's most important tourist villages. It's located on the slopes of the Alps in southern Switzerland, on the border with Italy. The village is car-free, which means that cars are forbidden to enter, and is considered the purest village in the world. Only electric cars or electric cabs can be found in the village and all travel is on foot or in horse-drawn carts. Strolling through the village is a program in itself as it is famous for its architecture and carvings and contains old structures and wooden houses with a long history. One of its main landmarks is Matterhorn, the fifth highest peak in the Alps. It is famous in winter and is known as the ski capital, with 360 kilometers of ski runs. The village is two and a half hours from Interlaken and can be reached by train from Tach station, which is the last station accessible by car. One-way tickets cost 16 francs. Many people ask about the red glass train called the Glacier Express. Of course, it reaches Zermatt, but the journey is eight hours and the train has several stations, which we talked about in detail in the last episode. So watch the episode, you'll find it very important. The important thing is that I mentioned, there are hundreds of beautiful villages in Switzerland, most of them set between alpine pastures and glaciers. There are many hiking trails surrounded by nature and snow-capped mountains. Some villages are very close to Interlaken, like Wilderswil. There are good mountain huts and hotels to stay in, such as the Hotel Yangfro. It offers a charming view of the Yangfro mountain, and the breakfast buffet was very good. The region was very quiet and beautiful, only three kilometers from Interlaken, and the train was very close to the hotel. As I've already mentioned, Interlaken is the center of all these programs and villages, and they're all easily accessible from the town of Interlaken. This town offers everything a tourist needs. It's a beautiful town with surrounding nature markets and promenades. There are international and local stores, and the best experience is the Arabic and local restaurants scattered around. And don't forget to try Swiss chocolate or take one of the chocolate courses. Interlaken is also known as the city of adventure. It's possible to discover Lake Brienz by jet boat. It's a fun adventure with high speed and exciting 360 degree turns. The cost of the adventure is around 100 francs. You can also discover the Aya River by rafting. Stimulating waves, rapids and fun moves through magnificent landscapes and valleys. Tickets cost around 120 francs. A 
Of course, Interlaken is also famous for paragliding flight over the mountains and the town of Interlaken. An unforgettable adventure. And the price is around 170 francs. Finally, don't forget to visit the Gesbach Falls, one of the most beautiful waterfalls in Switzerland. So here is Switzerland, its most beautiful villages and its best tourist programs. Switzerland is one of the most beautiful countries in the world. Every corner of this country is considered as an artistic painting. Thank you so much for watching this episode. And don't forget to subscribe to receive our new videos.